For breakfast, I'm having a homemade egg McMuffin and half a cup of cantaloupe. And how I made my egg McMuffin, I've got the whole wheat English muffin, this is the Dempster's one, toasted it, have a slice, a light cheese slice, this is Black Diamond, it's from Walmart. Then I used two eggs and one slice of this smoked Black Forest ham from Costco and I made a Nick Muffin, get it? Cause I'm cool with. Okay, um, I'm also having a large black coffee and a diet pop and this is the peach zero sugar Pepsi. If you haven't tried it yet, you got to. It's really good. I wanted to do a full day of eating to show you guys how I get in easily 150 grams of protein and lose body fat. I've been eating 1700 calories because I've been working on getting lean for summer and it's working so well for me. Look, look, I'm lean, Whoa. lean, but I'm not mean. You're not even gonna believe how much cool food I fit in my calories. I'm super excited. You're gonna love it, honey. So stay tuned. The calories for this breakfast is 357 and 30 grams of protein. We're gonna be buff. We're gonna be lean. We're gonna be sweet. Mmm. <laughs> that looks awesome. Mm. You got your eggs really puffy. Mmm. McDonald's lookout. We are going to the mall to do cardio because it's pouring outside and Cardio doesn't have to be boring or always done on a treadmill. Sometimes like I do an hour of cardio six days a week and sometimes it's fun to change things up and like go shopping and get my cardio in at the same time. So anyway, we were gonna pack our lunch um, to take with us, but Sassy took too long to get ready. So we're gonna eat it here. All lies, <laughs> do not believe anything she says even though she's telling the truth. <laughs> But anyway, so I had them in bento box form and like Kyle's breakfast is like double my calories and more protein. Same and then, food. yeah, it's same food, but like double my calories and, and more protein. Yeah. And then the rest of the day he eats similar. So we both have the exact same amount in each container. So what I'm having is 30 grams of light cheese and I'm using the marble great value. Then three quarters of a cup of cucumber spears, 55 grams of turkey kielbasa, and this is the brand turkey kielbasa from Walmart. Brand. Brand or brand? Brand, something like that. Something like that, turkey kielbasa. And then I've got 30 grams of wheat thins, the multi-grain kind. And then in this is a Greek yogurt ranch dip made with a third cup of plain fat-free Greek yogurt, and this is the one from Costco, and two teaspoons of this Clubhouse Ranch powder. How I'm able to lose fat um, by being in a calorie deficit and get in this much protein is that when I make up a meal, I try to choose as many low-cal foods that have a decent amount of protein as I can and put it all in one meal. So like the cheese has protein, the turkey kielbasa has protein, whole grain carbs have a little bit of protein in them and then Having a tasty dip made with Greek yogurt allows me to sneak even more protein in there so it all adds together and then makes a really decent protein amount. That's so, the sneaky one, the, the dip, because usually you know you write off the dip as not having much protein. Exactly, and that's why lately I've been into mixing the Greek yogurt with different like soup mixes and powders like this. It's a great way to make a savory high protein dip that's low cal. So like look at the amount that we're getting. like. It's huge and it's got a lot of protein and so you can really dip your cukes in there, man. Um, so, <laughs> oh, also I've had two bottles of water, just so you know like how much water I take in as well. Calories for this whole box, believe it or not, is only 337 cals and 29 grams of protein. And that's how I do it, low cal, high volume, 
packed with protein. Today at McDonald's, the Big Mac has shrunk. So a Big Mac is about 500 calories and it's about that size versus all that volume. Yeah, and like this morning, um, there was protein pretty much in every single item too, except for the fruit. The cheese, a cheese slice actually has like four grams of protein in it. So like that's how I really build in a lot of protein in every meal by looking at the labels and I try to choose the lowest cow one with the most protein. I've lost 130 pounds, so has Kyle, and we've both kept it off for over nine years and prioritizing protein is one of the biggest things that help us be successful because protein lowers your hunger hormone ghrelin and it helps you feel fuller longer. Kyle and I both have massive appetites. We're always hungry and it's normal to be hungry when you're eating in a calorie deficit. So protein at every meal really helps set us up for success. Plus we learned about ourselves on our weight loss journey. We like to work smarter, not harder. So we're always looking for ways to maximize our results while not putting in a lot of work. So all the meals that you often see us make, especially like in today's video, they're very quick and easy and really tasty as well as having a ton of protein. Because if we don't like what we're eating or it takes way too long, we're not gonna stick to it. It's gotta be quick, easy, tasty, high protein, and we gotta be able to find it somewhere like Walmart where because we're on a budget and we live in Canada, so we don't have a ton of options. So we, we gotta have it easy. And that's how we do it. And if you wanna know how I got my leanest body ever, like exactly how I get lean, you can buy my weight loss ebook. It's called Leaner Not Meaner, cause like I get lean, but not mean, honey. Um, the link's down below and code Nicole will save you 10%. This book has my exact cardio and weight training plan, my four week meal plan, plus 24 tasty recipes. It's like spending a month with me because often you guys will say like, I wish I could be a fly on the wall or spend time with you to see how you do stuff. Well, this book is basically like being with me for a month. So check it out, links down there, honey. We're gonna eat this and then go cardio at the mall. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's have a little sweet treat. Look, my dress has pockets. Whoa. I can put my uh, crackers in here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's top it up, honey. Whoa. Oh, yeah, that's beautiful, love life. That looks great. Ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho, sassy, cool it. We're rocking now. We got back from the mall. We ended up coming home with a record player, records, a whole whack ton of new walking clothes, like shorts and um, tank tops and stuff. Old lady <laughs> was having a Canada Day sale. Yeah, 50% because fifty percent off. Yeah, because it's Canada Day uh, weekend. We're when we're filming this, yeah, 50% off everything. So I literally got like six pairs of bike shorts, a couple like sports tops. Kyle got lots of tank tops and shorts and yeah, a record player. <laughs> and now we're hungry and ready for dinner. We're having breakfast for dinner. Protein pancakes and a slice of turkey bacon. So the turkey bacon, this is my favorite. It's the applewood smoked turkey bacon, the butterball one. And then how I love to add protein to the protein pancakes. First, I use the Kodiak cakes because it tastes the most like pancakes to me. I'm not sponsored, but like we've tried a ton and these are the best protein pancake mixes, the Kodiak cakes. We like the chocolate chip one because who doesn't like chocolate? And then on the back, it tells you you can add more protein by adding an egg and milk. So I added an egg and then to add even more protein, I added protein milk. There's like a ton out there, Fairlife and um, I think Natrell has one. This one's Joya from Nielsen. It's 18 grams of protein per cup and it's only 110 cows for the cup. And I only use three quarters for the batch. Um, so that's how I made the protein pancake mix. And then I've got half a cup of frozen peaches that I thought in the microwave. The topping is a quarter cup of the plain fat-free Greek yogurt mixed with a teaspoon of the fat-free vanilla pudding mix. In Canada, when it says fat-free, it is also sugar-free. So, you know, just so you know. And then I've topped it 
We get half a tablespoon of this um, Smucker's 97% less sugar syrup, and it's also fat-free, and the calories are really baller on it. Like, that's for four tablespoons, and we're only using half a tablespoon. And then we are also getting Steve's Maple's low-cal syrup up to four tablespoons because it's only like one calorie for four. And we'll put that on after when we eat it, deciding on how like much we want. And then I'm also having some drinks with my dinner, uh, a, spar a sparkling, this is a sparkling apparently. This is a blackberry bubbly and a zero ginger ale, the Canada dry kind. Uh, I'm gonna get a fork and eat this for the friends. Back. Okay, I'm gonna take some of the topping and some peaches too. Ugh. This, that's some topping. That means I nailed it. <laughs> Calories for all of this, including the turkey bacon. 460 calories, and get ready for the protein. Drum roll, please. 37 grams, honey. Whoa. Hmm. Time for dessert. I am having half a cup of cantaloupe and a seco bar. And these are the HTLT SUPS Milky Crisp seco Bars. They're the new and improved ones. They are softer. And they're less cows, which I really love. 230 cows and 20 grams of protein. Greatest thing, it tastes like a chocolate bar, but with less sugar and more protein. Um, if you wanna try these out, code Nicole will save you 15% off and the link is down below. And I gotta tell you, we just got this box like about a week ago. Sassy and I have been really busy and we've been like at night not even wanting to make the easiest meals that we have like cottage cheese and peanut butter. We've just been like, I don't wanna make anything. So these have been really convenient to just grab them off the shelf and have them. Easy protein, super tasty. It fits in our cows for our little meals and stuff. Our favorite way to eat them is heating them in the microwave for 10 seconds because it really tastes like um, a really tasty dessert that way. And then we eat it with a knife and fork. It's so good, you gotta try it. I feel like it's a mix between a Milky Way and a crispy crunch, and that's kind of what it tastes like to me. Milky crisp. I don't know, let me know what you guys think if you tried them, what flavor you think it is. Calories for this meal with the cantaloupe and everything, 257 cows, 20 grams of protein. Whoa. Yeah. Great. <laughs> Come on. He always turns on the camera when I'm not ready. He's like, okay, are we ready? I'm like, not yet, honey. <laughs> We're still working here. <laughs> I'll wait. Don't rush the artist, bud. <laughs> Okay, I got all of, oh, by the way, this is the last meal of the day, and it's a little cute. I'm calling this a peanut butter cup cheesecake bowl. So, I got Sassy's set up over here to make his after, and then I got mine all set up. So, what we need, three quarters of a cup of the plain fat-free Greek yogurt. This is why we buy it in the big tubs because we literally use it for everything because it's such a good versatile protein source. So there we go in the bowl already. To make it cheesecakey, we need a tablespoon of the light cream cheese. This one's the Philadelphia one because it was on sale. And I let it sit out for like 10 minutes just to get at room temperature. We're gonna need 20 grams of protein powder. I'm using the new flavor from HTLT. Chocolate, peanut butter. Kyle and I have been using a scoop of this in our protein ice cream. It's a baller flavor, but- I like your new word, baller. 
I, I'm 40, I just discovered the word baller and I use it for everything and I'm not ashamed to say that. <laughs> Again, Code Nicole will save you 15% off and the link's down below. And they have a ton of really cool protein powders, but this one is new, so Kyle and I are using it for everything. So we got the 20 grams of protein powder, which is right there. And then for toppings, we need half of a sheet of graham crackers, so two little squares, and I'm using the Honey Made. I find it's the lowest calories. It's 130 cows for two sheets of crackers. And then we need a teaspoon of peanut butter baking chips, and this is the Reese's, the Hershey's Chip -its. and a teaspoon of milk chocolate chips, and the great value kind is my favorite. So I've just got them mixed there. Um, you can skip, like I have a fancy bowl, but you can skip this step. I just like it for thumbnail action. First, I'm gonna mix everything in this bowl. So the yogurt, the protein powder, and then I'm just gonna get the cream cheese in there. You know and what then, I had an idea for a business? What's your idea for a business? It's gonna be graham crackers. Okay. I'm gonna call it holy sheets. <laughs> I wasn't expecting none of this. I like that. I didn't expect that. Oh my. Yep. Yeah, I got, remember the other You're day I was really? saying that you know all my jokes? We've been together like 18 It'll be years or eight, so. 18 years in October and we'll be married for 11 years. But anyways, yeah. I was said, saying the other day, I have, like, I gotta get some new jokes because she knows, she says my jokes before I say them now, so I'm like, <laughs> but your, your routine's getting stale, you gotta come up with some new stuff. That's a good one, you did it, Sassy, nailed it, bud. So I am basically just going to keep mixing this until all the cream cheese is blended in along with the protein powder and the yogurt, and the protein powder will make this a little bit thicker, which is exactly what we want. So just go until the cream cheese is in there, and then I'll show you how I top it and everything. And you know why the holy turk is, the grand turk have little holes in That's a pretty, yeah, that's, you know, <laughs> I figured that was an add-on, but that was pretty good. Pretty good stuff. <laughs> uh, that's a good joke, Sassy, you made me laugh. Wow, but, first you know, time for everything. <laughs> You can obviously skip the fancy bowl step, but I'm going to but do. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna do Operation Fancy Bowl, and I'm just gonna put it in there. If you want to skip the fancy bowl step, feel free to not do that. He's loving cracking jokes. Like he's just like on fire here. I'm all dirty. <laughs> Take a shower. <laughs> I like food. Okay, so now we're just gonna do some graham crackers on one side. Just put it in there like so. And then we're gonna do the chips on this side. Come on, buddy. Chef Ramsey's shaking in his boots. Oh yeah, he's like, oh, I gotta run away, scared. That's what he does. That's exactly what he said. That's yeah. a direct quote. But does he have an accent though? Yeah, British. British? I think. I have to run, how's British? I have to run away scared. Is that good? Pretty good. <laughs> look at my bowl. <laughs> he took one look at your bowl. And he was I run away scared. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I normally eat my last meal around like nine, between nine and 10, and it's uh, 7.30 right now, so I'm actually gonna cover this up and put it in the fridge for later, and I'm gonna do the same for sassies, and that way all the flavors will meldy together and it'll be even better. You don't have to do that, but we're just gonna do that so we can go chill for a bit. So the whole calories for this bowl is 289 calories and 34 grams of protein. Isn't that a baller dessert? Holy like sheet. Everyone say baller in the comments just because it's really cool to say and you're gonna love it. You're gonna feel so great when you write that. Baller. Say holy sheet. And holy sheet. Okay, put holy sheets and baller in the comments. Just do it like that and sign. Holy sheets and sign baller. I was shaking my legs like this behind the counter. Okay, so <laughs> calories total for the day, 1,700, 50 grams of fat, 
175 grams of carbs, and 150 grams of protein. Yeah! The friends, weight loss should never be a punishment. Dieting does not have to be boring, and you don't have to hate your food. It can be quick, easy, and tasty. Find foods and meals that you love so that you can stick to what you're doing. And if you have a big appetite or you find yourself feeling hungry when you're in a calorie deficit, protein, protein, protein. And there are a ton of options out there. And you know, cherry pick some of the ideas you've seen in this video or like make your own, but prioritize protein, find low cal, high volume foods that you love and make up a cool meal plan that makes you excited. Like Kyle and I literally jump out of bed to eat our meals because we're so excited. And that's why we've been able to lose the weight, keep it off and get lean because we love what we eat and we love what we do for cardio. Like go to the mall. Sometimes we walk, but like we love, we're probably going to the mall again tomorrow because we need more records for a record player. So make it fun so that you can stick to it. Watch this vid and this vid for more fun, sustainable weight loss tips because Sass and I are real friends losing weight in the real world and we love tasty food. Let's give them a bonus and show them the record player and the two soundtracks. Okay, let's do it. All right, so we got this at Best Buy. This is our new record player. It also is a CD player and a cassette player. Yeah, like CD player. There's a cassette, uh, whatever deck down player there. Player thingy. And there's also a radio. And um, those are the two. Oh, it's a Victrola, by the way. And Victrola 7-in-1. Yeah, Victrola 7-in-1. And we got it from Best Buy in Canada. Um, and these are the two soundtracks. We actually got them at Toys R Us because they have like an HMV section now. So the Twin Peaks soundtrack, which we love the Twin Peaks series. And it is so good. We listened to it while we were making dinner. And then we also got the Blade Runner soundtrack. And we listened to that while we were eating dinner. It is and, jazzy oh, and yeah. atmospheric and amazing. And we love like atmospheric and jazzy music. So these are so, these are baller. They're baller. <laughs> <laughs> this was over for the record player, but I will just leave it in the shot. Thanks so much for watching, honey. I'll catch you in the next big cutie. Peace it, peace it, peace it. Bye. <laughs> <See> <laughs> Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up.